What do you hear? What do you say? This is Vertigo, and I have a treat for you today. Uh, as you know, I've been playing on Wild RP, uh, doing some roleplay in Red Dead Redemption 2, playing a character named Baz Kerrigan. Now, I haven't been just doing YouTube videos. I've been streaming uh, this character for weeks now, months, actually, and each stream goes for 8 to 10 hours. And as you can imagine, when you stream for 8 to 10 hours, and you turn that into a 20 to 40 minute video, there's a lot of footage left on the on the floor in the editing room. And that just doesn't do it justice because I've had a lot of interactions and side plots that are absolute gold that just don't quite make the main plot that I'm sticking to for the videos. And I thought, why waste those? So what I'm going to do starting from today is start uploading some of the side stories, less edited, um, just to show you guys some of the really cool interactions and stories that happen on a daily basis in Wild RP. This very first one, let me just set the, the, the stage for you. This takes place directly after episode 5. I just choked out Braithwaite, the deputy, um, and I'm on the run. I've cut my hair, I've changed my clothes, maybe an hour or two have gone by, and I'm on the run from the law. And we basically instantly run into Braithwaite, and then we run into him again, and it is insane. I can't even explain to you what happens in this video. You just have to watch for yourself. You're gonna like it, I think. And if you do enjoy this kind of side content, extra footage, please let me know down below. I'd love to hear your feedback on this because there's a lot of things that happen like this that I could put onto YouTube. And um, yeah, I'd love your feedback. But before we start, a small message from my sponsor. Special thank you to NordVPN for sponsoring this video. NordVPN is the safest, most reliable, and fastest VPN on the planet. And I personally use it daily. Why do I use it? Well, that's simple. I live in Australia, and if you're Australian, you know that we're locked off from a lot of content when it comes to streaming services. We just don't have the library like America does. But with NordVPN, that doesn't matter anymore because all I need to do is log into my account, change my location to America, and now I have access to every single TV show and movie that's available in the United States. And it is so simple. Just a couple clicks and you're done. But don't take my word for it. I'm going to hook you up with an amazing deal. And not only that, if you're unhappy with it, you get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you go to nordvpn.com forward slash vertigo or click on the link in the description, you can get yourself a two-year plan plus four months free at a huge discount of 73% off. Wait, what? Seven? No, that can't. Yeah, it's 73% off. I mean, you're not going to get a much better deal than that. So go to nordvpn.com forward slash vertigo or click on the link in the description and get your awesome deal today. <laughs> As he went back to Valentine, shot up, shot up the town. He went walking out of town and started shooting up. Just he's just randomly with his gun. He was drunk. And then Braithwaite spoke to him and then he attacked Braithwaite and ran away. And then Braithwaite caught up to him, and then he, I choked Braithwaite out, and now I'm on the run. From the law. I just want to say, I'm so, so sorry. It's part of her story. I've been dreading telling Baz. No, 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 don't be sorry. It's perfect. It's perfect. I love it. It's more, it's more interesting this way. Don't... Oh! Out of here, friend. <clears throat> Jack, is it? Mm-hmm. Uh huh. What's your name, friend? Yeah, what's the name? <clears throat> Say, Philly. Your name wouldn't happen to be, uh, Jack, or Beckett, or shit, even Moxie. Any of these names ringing a bell? Doesn't seem so. Why don't you take that hat off? Humor me. No, yeah, it's not. No, oh, well, never mind. All right, sir, Appreciate be on your it. way. Have a good one. 
Yes! Oh my god, I almost had a fucking heart attack! Oh man! Were you all clenching as well? <laughs> we'll go to we'll go to Rhodes and if there's no one there and there's no jobs there, we can go to Annisburg. I think Annisburg is where all the fucking like hardcore outlaws hang out. Oh shit! What kind of fucking speed was that? We didn't do it! Oh, fuck! Oh, we're fucked! She was flying! I saw it coming too! Kill my horse, you son of a bitch! I didn't do nothing! You fucking hot dick, you're going so fucking fast down the road down there! Oh, I'm going fast. You fucking idiot! Oh, I That's why your horse is dead and mine's alive, because you're an idiot! Way, uh, yeah, fuck you! Mr. Listen, we gotta figure something out. I can't get caught here. I just stole that horse. Oh shit. Well, uh... Alright, well that makes two of us then. <laughs> oh, and you killed my horse that I borrowed. Alright, listen here, listen here, listen here. Um... I'll cover for you if you cover for me, eh? Yeah? Alright, now we're gonna do that. Alright, in here, there was a fucking there. Uh, let's just say there was a wild animal crossing the road. Speak up, you bastard. There was a wild animal crossing the road, and we both hit it, yeah? That's right, there was a chupacabra right in the road. Listen, I've got an idea. Not many people know me, do many people know you? Nope, I am unknown. My name is Bob Smith. No, right, Bob. My name's Mrs. Buttersworth. Listen, I'll cover for you if you cover for me, and I only need two cigarettes. All right, all right. I'll do that this for you. This craziness is impossible to script. <laughs> right. Chat's on their sixth heart attack in two hours. <laughs> listen, listen up. Hear this, though, okay? If anyone asks, you know me, okay? Um, I, I can't talk, all right? Say that I'm a, I'm a mute. Yeah? Look. Oh, shit. Who is it? Bob! My husband, Bob! Oh, help! Oh, That's not fucking stone. Bob is hurt. Fucking oh, fuck me! God damn it! What the f No! Oh, <laughs> there was a chupacabra in the road. We both hit it. Can you please help us? Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Forget my husband. You hear me? He's completely knocked out. Fucking hell. <laughs> Drag him. Oh you little fucking shit. Oh. Hey, are you okay? Help me! No, help! Oh, oh help! Oh. Help! Oh, gotcha! I gotcha! Okay, okay, hold on! Uh, mute. Oh my fucking god! What is oh, going I'll on in here? Uh, uh, oh god! Wait, this is a this is a mute. Who needs the help? I oh, I just came across uh, this too, but I had to have a piss. Oh, I'll go to Rhodes. Oh, <laughs> Don't you leave me here? Little fucking stole my fucking horse. <laughs> oh, this is a fucking pain in the arse. <laughs> Where's the uh? There a doctor's office in Rhodes. There's a doctor helping some folk out by the bank. Some lady come in with another lady on a horse. She did over by the bank. Thanks. Why am I dead? Because some fucking lunatic was riding a hundred miles an hour on the I road and ran into me. That's why. 
She's gonna help you, Bob. Bring him up, y'all. Bring him up, y'all. Oh, yeah. Just find a coffin for him. No, that's my husband. Oh, Bob. <laughs> Why didn't you write a sender name? There's a proper office there. <laughs> Bob! Bob! <laughs> Going on. I'm in the middle of the fucking road. Alright, up you go. Oh, Take it off. There we go. Oh, who the fuck are these? Uh, actually, I would recommend heading to the medical office hello. in Sentinel, okay? Uh, hey, no, Miss Warren. And where's my fucking horse? I got the rifle. Hells yeah. Oh, hey there. Oh, fuck yeah, get the fuck away from me. <laughs> We're not married no more. I don't want a divorce. Get the fuck away from me. Why? I don't like you no more. Get the fuck away from me. Look at my boobies. Get the fuck away from me. Look. It's over. Get the fuck. Move on with your life. <laughs> That's rude. Oh! oh, you fucking bitch. You fucking whore. Fuck. I know all these people. Baz knows all these people. Fuck, maybe we're too close to fucking Valentine. Women recognize voices better. Hey, I'm doing a good, I'm doing a good, uh, disguise voice. I think we should be fine. I think I'm, I think I'm nailing it. We need a drink of fucking water though. Holy shit. Let's eat some chicken. Van Horn has all the crazies. Yeah, we don't want to go to the crazies, man. You're a piece of shit. Oh, you fucking bitch. Why are you so mean to me? Because I don't like you. That's why I don't why? like you. I covered for you. No, you fucking bitch. You're fucking going so fucking fast in the road you over said there. You cover for me. You. What are you talking about? You, you fucking. Said you whore. You fucking whore. Get the fuck away from me. Don't call me a whore no more. I'm not that thing no more, Bob. I'm not that thing you no fucking, more. You fucking. There you go. There you go. Oh god, let go of her! Oh god, I didn't mean to go! I didn't mean to track her for that long! Yeah, Shit! I didn't mean to run! I didn't mean to do that! That was an accident! That was an accident! I didn't mean to do that! That was an accident! Fuck, we- Oh no! I didn't mean to do that. What are you following me for? <laughs> I didn't know that was going to keep dragging her like that, man. I swear. <laughs> fucking hell. But now, now this fucking character's wanted. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta hide, we gotta hide! The crops! Whoa! You alright? Uh, uh, yeah. Keep running! <laughs> Is that not why they... How do I crouch? Okay. Get down, get down. What the, what the hell are we doing? What the fuck are you following me for? You didn't even do anything. I I, I was backing up my, my fellow uh, my fellow female. It wasn't, I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to, I, was, I pulled up the horse there and I was trying to ride away, but I didn't mean for the rope to get caught up like that. Oh no. Oh, well, now she's, she's gonna be like real pissed. She was already angry before. Oh, well, I'm more concerned about the fucking deputies that saw me there. Uh, yeah, I will. I, I do would be worried about the deputies that saw you there. I'm gonna have to fucking close my. I'm gonna have to fucking change my whole goddamn attire again, goddammit! Or was that gonna consist of shaving off that that soup strainer? Oh, you fucking bitch! I am many things, and a bitch is one of them. Fuck! Fuck! That'll cost you. Shut up! Just shut the fuck up, alright? Gonna think about this. <sighs> yeah, I, I feel like this is gonna be painful for you. For me? Thinking. Oh, you fucking oh, you I'm fucking you, know, you want the you want the, uh, the the backhand from down under? Is that what you want? 
The, the backhand from down under. Mm. I know a lot of positions, but I've never heard of that. All right, get the fuck away from me. Oh, fuck. oh what if I don't want to? Oh, God, stop. Right, they're, right there, they're right there. They're right there. Check the and on the mark. They're right there. Well, stop moving so much. Help! Oh, help, you I fucking whore! Fuck! <laughs> oh, you fucking bitch! Oh. Okay, alright, alright, this is over. The jig's up. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Let's calm down here. Let's calm down. I got my hands up here. It's alright, it's alright. Mr. Smith. Yes. You mind telling me what the fuck you think you're doing? Alright, well, here, listen here. My uh, my wife over here backhanded me, and I went to the I, I, I threw a rope on her because I wanted to pull her off her horse to put her in her place there, and then uh, I rode off. I didn't intend for the rope to get caught up on her like that. It was an accident, and then I saw you chasing me, and it was a moment of madness, and I panicked and ran. I apologize. Okay, well, would you mind coming back to the station, so we can have a discussion? Sure, but she's not gonna press any charges. She's my wife. I mean, between the rain and her crying on my back, I'm soaked out here, Mr. Bob. Would you, you I, bitch, would you stop fucking crying, please? You know I was a dead bag. Oh, 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 Get on the back of my horse, sir. Jesus Christ. Right, I'll get on the bed. I'll get on the bed. This, this goddamn no whaling. <laughs> this is just going so bad. Why is everything going bad? Oh, fucking god damn it. Oh, don't forget the lane. Shut up, you bitch. Hey, <laughs> that's enough. Excuse me, sir. That's my wife. What we, what I said to my wife isn't really your concern, is it? She, she deserves a modicum not. of respect. I watched you rope that lady off the damn did horse and drag her, her down the street. Did you watch her backhand me first? Did you see that? No, you I didn't, did you? That. I just heard you yell. <laughs> oh, you fucking whore. <laughs> uh, he called me a whore because when I was Please restrain yourself. Your tongue. Oh, for fuck's sake, stop telling him shit. I get your fucking bitch. Just shut the fuck up. Come over there. I'll fucking hit you again. Jesus Christ, Carter, let's just get back to the station soon. Yeah, we, we need a special piece to uh... Mr. Deputy, I think it'd be smarter just to let us go here. This ain't worth your fucking time. Trust me, we'll pick. I'm about to mark that on my map there. All right. This is Carter. He's the one that. Yeah, these are wild pigs. Yeah, excellent. Listen, listen. Listen. I'm listening. Is there anything we can do here to, uh, you know, to forget the whole thing, there? Listen, we'll have a conversation, see how it goes. All right, all right. Just know that she's not an innocent lady, all right? She's fucking playing you like a fiddle. Listen, all I see, all I see, I walk out of the office. I understand. I hear shouting. I understand. I couldn't, I couldn't tell who's shouting. Yeah, I understand. It, 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 it didn't look good. I, I, I grant you that it didn't look good at all. Did not look good. No. I understand. But uh, honestly, it's just a civil dispute between man and wife. That's all. Gotcha. Well, maybe you should take your civil di disputes to I agree. I, I agree. Just don't let her drag this out because she's been after my fucking money for years. <laughs> How has this happened to me? All right. When we get into the office, I'm going to have to ask you to place your weapons on the side for me. Yeah. I understand. You mind if I take my coat off here? Yeah, take your coat off. All right. You put your weapons on the desk and then just stick your coat off. It's fine. All right. Okay, you want to take a seat? Oh, uh, all right. Shit. All right. I Just have seated. One moment. Oh, do you have to get the little book out? Is that really necessary, dear? 
I just want to make sure I got a statement, then I'm going to document everything. Just in case something else comes up If he figures out I'm Baz, uh, Buford's going to be... He, like, not Buford, Braveweight will be here very fucking quickly. I got to get out of this. I have to get out of this. <clears throat> All right. Hold on, hold on. Not a problem. I think my voice is okay, just... I'm ready. Well, let's, let's start with your name first. Bob Smith. Bob Smith. And the, the name of the lady that you had the altercation with? Whore Smith. That's her name. Correct. That's her, her legal bonded name. Honestly, I forgot what her name was. I've been calling her whore for a long fucking time. I don't remember her first name. Whore Smith. Okay, so do you mind just explaining how we got to the point of you roping her? Yeah, no problem. She came up to me, and uh, she was a little upset because we had a little accident going on to St. Denis Day, and um, she backhanded me right in front of the other lady there. And I thought, fuck this. I got my lasso out, and I put off the fucking horse there. And... Uh, I was going to leave because I didn't want to be around her for any longer. And uh, unfortunately, the rope uh, got caught on her leg there. And I dragged her halfway up the fucking street. Uh, I looked back, noticed what had happened. I saw you charging at me and I, I panicked and uh, rode off. Okay, okay. Is she still fucking wailing? Oh, you fucking bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cry it up, cry it up. Unfucking believable. You believe this shit? Lay down, do you, you do that. Just warm your bones by this fire, okay? Warm your okay. buns. Car, yeah. does, Car, does this lady have, have a name? Anymore. Um, Mrs. Buttersworth is her name. No, Mrs. it's not. Buttersworth. No, it's not. It's that, Mrs. She Smith. Told, She's lying she told, to you. She told me she 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 don't want your name. I'm, I, that's fine with me. I want a fucking divorce as well. Get the fuck out of my life, you bitch. Easy. Okay, so, uh... You, um, you are something, sir. With me, I'm something? Are you fucking kidding me? Do you hear everything? I the mean, dramatization? Only, only one of the two of you are throwing insults like this. She's, she's, she's playing you like a fiddle, sir. <laughs> okay, Bob. That little bad little Bob doesn't work anymore, Bob. You that fucking little, bitch. Okay. Let's, I don't let's work not because be, I know eventually when we get divorced, you're going to try to take all my money, but that ain't happening, is it, bitch? No, it's not. My money, you're broke. Hey, let's, Fuck, let's not be throwing insults to each other. That's enough. All right, continue. Okay. So you you accidentally you had this altercation in the street. You accidentally roped her. Up. Well, you were meant to rope. I her, meant to rope her up. Yes. You saw, her, you saw us, and then you fled. But the rope was still connected to the ankle. Correct. That was the accident. Okay. Yeah. Well, listen, listen, Mister Mister Smith, your your attitude stinks. No, I mean, I'm, I'm, tell, I'm being honest with you here. I mean, that, that's, that's the good attitude oh, no, to have with the I'm, law, is it not? I know you, yeah, you are. But the way you, you treating that lady right there is just, just disgusting. Do you know, do you know what's crazy? Is that she's acting like the victim here, but she's the fucking worst. She fucking says a lot of things that you don't know about. Listen, I believe me and you, I saw her chasing you with a fucking axe, so I, I kind of see where you're coming from. Yeah, this marriage was not made in heaven, I tell you that much, and it's over! It's fucking over! I I'm gonna see if I can find a doctor idea. to look her over, okay? Do you want to take her with you, Kai? Yeah, please. This is not a good idea yeah. to have these two. Please, <laughs> please. Together. Okay, all right. I'll take her, please. I beg you. Shut your damn mouth, sir. All right. Listen, I apologize here, right? I mean, there's no, there's no harm done here. It's just a fucking altercation that we've had billions, <coughs> hundreds. You see what I mean? You fucking. Miss. Yeah, you. Ah! God damn it. If only we dragged her a little bit further there, that might have been the fucking thing to do. Fuck. Listen. <clears throat> I apologize, oh, alright? I apologize. This is between me and her. We're going to sort our differences down. The divorce papers are going to go through and this is never going to happen again. I understand that you as a deputy have a duty to look after and keep the citizens here safe. I understand that I caused a bit of a disturbance there. But all in all, no harm is really done except for our fucking marriage, which is coming to a complete halt. 
And uh, then we can, you can just let us off with a warning. Yeah, she's still going, you hear that? I did. Liz, uh, see, the thing is, I would have given you a warning if we didn't have whatever just happened in this damn office. She spat on my face. However, Are you fucking kidding me? She did, and she will she will get uh, reprimanded for that. However, right now I'm dealing with you, sir, trying, Mr. Brady. Smith. You what? I'm dealing with you right now. All right, I understand. I understand. But listen, man to man, all right? Man to man. Are you married? No, I'm not. Well, I hope in your case, when you do eventually get wed, that you don't marry a fucking dragon like that one out there. I, I, I imagine that she's got a fiery temper. I saw yeah, that. I saw yeah. her chasing you through fields with a fucking axe out. I saw it. Yeah, good. But I also can't dismiss the fact of what I've seen outside. And I understand that you saw it. And, but then the insults you flew at I her mean, whilst you I mean, there's no law. Too. There's no law for insults, deputy. No, absolutely not. It just did not help the situation. I understand. It kind of made me seem clearer. I'm, I, I, I'm being completely honest with you. Okay, I'm being very honest with you. I'm not trying to, uh, you know, say anything untoward that is uh, not true. I'm just, uh, I just, I, I, I got to get out of this relationship, and I'd love to leave town and just never see her again. To be honest with you. Okay, listen. Yeah. All right, because because you've been honest with me, I. <sighs> so the charge would be assault and battery, right? I mean, is she pressing charges? I can ask her. I think that's probably the best thing to do. You better fucking say no, otherwise I'm pressing charges as well. You hear that? If you're pressing charges, you bitch, I'm gonna press them too. You no think way. about that? I'm gonna tell him your secret. What? Bob. Just okay. You Just give me a minute, that? Mr. Smith. Let me speak to her. Yeah, you do that. Fuck. <laughs> we gotta get out of this, I man. So much to tell you about Bob. <sighs> Run? No. No, there's no way out. There's a back door. It's 100% locked. This is going to be locked. I can guarantee it. And I, I can get out of this. I can get out of this maybe with a small fine. Maybe. I'm not going to jail. Pushes up her cleavage? What the fuck is going on out there? What the fuck is going on out there? She is she's showing cleavage to try and get Oh you cunt. Oh my god. Excuse me, sir. You get to the tip lines. Mm hmm? Were you in here for questioning? Mm hmm? And Deputy Carter out there? Mm -hmm. Senior, I should say. Mm hmm You ain't the fella we met earlier, the bald head? Mm-hmm. No, oh, nice to meet you. Mm-hmm. Not the big talker, are you? Mm-mm. I can't deal with this, man. I can't fucking deal with this. <laughs> if I grab my guns, we are getting arrested. You understand that? We will go to jail. We will go to jail. It's so fucking close. I'm aware of how close this is. And I thought... Being on the run was going to be a lot easier than this. We've almost been caught like fucking six times. And we could still get caught. I need to get out of this situation and just leave this fucking town, dude. Fuck. Oh, 
I don't know how I'm going to put this all, this all this into a video. And this is fucking madness. Oh, who is that now? Oh, fuck. Oh, no. You got it. Situation, Carter. Uh, well, we had heard a bit of an altercation in the street, and uh, this fella here, I walk out the door, and he, he's got his ropes out, and he roped a lady off a horse and starts dragging it down the goddamn street. Is that Times right? It, yeah, I met this fella. You don't talk much. He talking to you? Oh, he's talking to, he's talking a whole lot before. All right, don't let me interrupt. Is he, 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 Mr. Smith? He? Okay, you 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 can hear me. Mm -hmm. Hey, Kai, okay. this is Mr. Smith. Oh, I, I I'm aware. Wow. Yeah. The, the woman outside there mentioned something about Mr. Stone. Hmm? Yeah, you see, Mr. Stone, Stone. It, it was quite worried. He was talking to some fellow down Saint Denis, all dressed in black, and just sent him all over the sorts. I was thinking it's the same. Fella dressed in black that I saw, but I don't know. Well, this fella is any more description of a fella dressed in all black because that is yeah. very vague. Oh well, you know. I didn't know I was up against the tribunal. Now did I Not try? You, you idiot! I'm talking about him. Give me a break, huh? I'm saying you get on my ass. Some fucking fair little dress it all in black. That's great. Well, fantastic. What the hell can we do with that? Listen, I'm just bringing it up. I know. But you mentioned I'm Mr. Stone, and Mr. Stone made it a, 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 a quite Stone? a little. Wait, what does Stone got to do with this? Yeah, Stone. I don't know. I'm trying to find out what Stone has to do with this. Would you listen up, huh? Or is those mutton chops, uh, Theodore Senior? They getting in your ears? Huh? I will fucking slap you both ways. Really? I wouldn't disobey you like that, but I'm just saying, things are connecting here. So you're saying this village has a. I'm just saying it's funny by. you mentioned Stone, because Stone just told me down St. Denis that he was accosted by a man dressed in full black at the telegram station. And I was wondering, is the same fella that I met down St. Denis dressed in black coming on into the place? I don't know. Uh, well, I'll, I'll leave it to you, fellas. I'm sorry for interrupting. Well, I don't know what the the thing is. The, the lady out there said something about he was trying to avoid Mr. Stone. I, I don't I don't know the situation really, unless he Mr. Smith here would like to enlighten me. Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Are you all right? He can't lost the, the cat lost your tongue. Mm. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Cat mm -hmm. lost his tongue. Mm -hmm. Got your tongue. Mm -hmm. Cat got your tongue. That's the mm -hmm. one. Anyway, she she would like to press charges, Mr. Smith. So I, I will I will be charging you with assault and battery today. Mm. Right, for roping the lady, dragging her down the street. Obviously, it's a seventy dollar fine, thirty days. But because you've been in here quite a while already, I'll take it down to fifteen days. Mm. Mm -hmm. Too generous, senior. Well, he's already that served some time sitting in this chair. Hold on here. What so about the guns people. on the table there? Can I take that? Wait, you will be able to have the guns you, back. Wrong with he, 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 why are you talking differently? Yeah, just a little bit of pain here, that's all. Well, where did this pain Listen, come from? The, 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 I have uh, to bocus. <coughs> to bocus? Oh, he got the TV? Oh, jeez. Oh, right. Who the fuck got the TV? Get him out of my office. Get him out. Charge him or something. Get him out of here, Carter. Get him out of here. Get him. Get out. Oh, don't leave. I'm getting out. Oh, no. You're making me. Get the fuck out. Get the weapons and get the fuck out. I'm in it. We have them, don't breathe. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Jesus. Get the fuck out of this.